Hello and welcome my friends, I'm Daily Fix and we are continuing with EU4. It's a new day for me, yes it might sound surprising. I've been so hooked on this game that I find it very very difficult to stop. Now there are a few things that I want to start doing. I would like to get this guy back, he's just improving with my neighbors and I want to use him to start fabricating on Galro once he starts returning. I want to do the fabrication game again on all of my uh, neighboring territories, uh, perhaps except Thier, although I have a feeling that he might stab me in the back eventually. Um, I still want to vassalize Cleave so we don't get too much aggressive expansion but in Friesland I actually want to take this province. The reason for it is because we actually have a state over here and this is all easily to develop lands and gives us, giving us coastal regions. We need to pay off our loan and well there's a lot of things that we need to do. Actually, we're still waiting here for this um, rebel faction to die out. Now, it's not as much. Um, as you can see, the unrest here is 1.3. And it is mainly because they consider me to be cruel. Which is very annoying. And it's still going to take us a long time to get rid of the autonomy. Um, but perhaps we can actually lower the army maintenance so we make a tiny bit more monies because the uprising is going to take 12.8 years so let's go halfway that we actually just make over a docket and see what kind of result it has on this uh well rebel faction 1.3 12.8 let's take a look here the first is coming up so it's actually L13.8 it didn't change much so we are able to start uh, still try to pay off our debt unfortunately this loan January well maybe no no we, we we will definitely have to extend this loan which is uh, unfortunate to say uh, the least do we want to drop this down even more hmm no no, actually I don't. It's unfortunate. It is. Now, we do get the, the Golden Age for us. I'm not sure it was a good thing to trigger it already. Although I don't really see a reason not to. Uh, but we'll just see. Let us get this guy back. He's back. Let's go and send you over here to Galra to build up that spy network. Uh, we're just going to let this stick. If we can get claims on these two provinces, I'm happy. We might be able to get two provinces as well. As long as we just vassalize him, things are fine. We do need to make sure that this fellow over here, his allies are in war. And even though, yeah, I don't want to fight like um, England as well as Burgundy. Clarity gains... 10 loyalty at the cost of 50 admin. Ah, devotion is already so low. Oh, we're making 5. Devotion will tick up. But this is also costing us prestige. And we're not gaining as much. So I would like to start to increase devotion. Also... <laughs> Yeah, the power projection is below 50 and I hate it. I truly hate it. Um, actually, this doesn't give me devotion. It just gives me loyalty to the Clarity. What can the Clarity do for me with that kind of loyalty? Uh, oh, that's funny. Okay, we're trading. So we'll take this and we demand the support and we didn't lose anything. How about that? I think that was a good trade-off. We didn't lose anything. We didn't gain anything either. So no lack in devotion. You're still doing quite well for my ships. I like it. Uh, we do want to take more ships. We can take up another three. Before the sailors get a, become a problem. Also the rebels. They, um, they've defeated the Oldenburg armies. Which is funny. I like that. Let's get a claim on Friesland. Do we have truces? When? 
So actually we do not have a truce with Friesland at the moment. And you are pals with East Frisia and Brittany. Now Brittany, it is a long ass way for him to get over here. So if we are going to be declaring, we're going to be putting our ships back since we cannot take these uh, 10. You are part of the HRE. How many troops do you have, Utrecht? Let's take a look here. So, eight. So, it is still a considerable force. Uh, I want to wait until we have a claim on uh, Oversight here as well. Oversticht. Oversticht. Okay, whatever. And uh, let's build up more on Galra. Uh, this will give us more time to have the uh, rebellion die out. People elected a, in Aragon. Okay, cool. So it, this is now Aragon. We cannot take the plus one stability, which is uh, unfortunate. I would like to have that. Austria. Yeah, we are backing Austria again. Uh, we'll just have to see. Eventually, I will not go any further. Core creation cost negative 10 is still nice. Diplomatic relation is nice. Eventually, this is getting to a point where it becomes dangerous. Imperial Autonomy Growth Modifier. Um, embolishes the elected monarchy of the uh, Holy Roman Empire. Emperor. This will actually get me out of the game. The HRE is now always inherited by the same country. This allowing internal HRE wars. So this one we're already not taking. We can actually, actually get up all the way to here and then we will not back this up. I don't think Austria is going to stay uh, the Emperor. I think they're actually... Are you at war at the moment? It does appear that you are at war. With Poland, Moldavia... And Poland did not call me in and I'm very, very much grateful for him. The, uh, the war is not really going in his favor. Austria, you did not join the war. Actually, that is funny. Are you losing this then, Poland? No, I don't think so. Denmark, Sweden and Norway. Wow. Yeah, that might be a big pill to swallow there. Since he's fighting all of this. Eventually, the uh, are you still vassalized? Yeah, you are still a member of Denmark. Interesting. Eventually, they will break away and then Denmark is no longer the big old powerhouse they are right now. Um, but that's probably going to take us a bit longer. Uh, hopefully we can actually build up more in treasury. I want to get rid of this loan. Now, how much interest are we actually paying? Like 0 0.12. Uh, that's annoying. Nobility influence decreasing, which is good. Can we get actually ask for contribution? No. How about you? I don't need this at the moment. Actually, the influence is greater. We already took this. This is the only thing that I would need them for. How about you? We can demand military support, losing them ten, uh, 20 loyalty. Do we need a new general? Not right now. The additional levies. That could be nice. But still, it's 15 loyalty. I would have to lose prestige, levies, and get the military support. If I have to choose, get the military support. Get that additional uh, 100. In terms of technology, we're still far ahead. And we'll get the message for the enforced services. Regiment cost negative 10 first. Uh, but we're not going to be taking it. Also, what's this? Cl a church administration. Stable stability cost modifier. Negative 10. Coring cost. We'll just see. Missionary strength. Yeah, maybe, maybe this eventually will change. If we stop being like this bishopry. And, and that will happen actually quite soon. Free politician or oh, policies. Free policies. 
I don't know what they're talking about. Policies. Free policy. So one free policy. Actually, we need. What we'll do? The land force limit modifier and diplomatic reputation, and it would be for free. So otherwise, it would cost me. I I don't think it's a very good reason. Hmm, we can actually boost the um, devotion. I'm sure there is something that will trigger all of this and, and it will start being bad and we'll have to do this. Maybe we can accept a uh, another culture since uh, we're very much Dutch at the moment. Innovativeness, Golden Era, it will cost us Bidiplo. Dutch belongs to the same culture group as the Orion is, so gives us a reduced penalty. Negative on manpower, sailors, and tax. Actually, are we getting a reduced penalty? That's annoying. I think we'll actually, um, it would benefit us to accept that culture. We can accept two more and accepting both. Would not be that bad of an idea. So you're West Philadelphia, you are, you are. Yeah, maybe we should do this. We have a, actually have a few of them. Only this one is, is Rhinish. Or Rhenish. I don't know what it will do, guys. So I'm terrified about this. But we're going to be uh, going ahead. And let's take a look here. 081. I will spend it on both. Uh, we are getting more income. Uh, did it do anything for the unrest? Uh, I, I actually don't know. Yeah, it did decrease the amount of time it will take to for this to spawn. How to deal with East Frisia? It's only two times, so he will be reinforced. Which is extremely annoying. For now, we can just get all of this down let's see what will happen five point six point five and wow it increased like crazy that should be enough i hope Well, you know what, well, here we go. Let's just raise the army maintenance. We'll be using it shortly anyways. Uh, we don't need this to tick. And actually, this dying out would be so much better. Since we just got this uh, territory anyways. Uh, that's why I want to start fabricating all over the place again. Uh, maybe in the next war. Well, we, when we help someone. And one of uh, the countries where we have a core on joins. Hey, who knows, we'll get some more territory. Uh, that actually would be nice. Yeah, this will die out. We can invest in a new idea group. Yeah, that figures. Yeah, like I said, I don't know if that is the way forward at the moment. Since it's only 25%, we'll wait until we hit uh, 600 and we'll take a look. And we actually do need to move our troops to Ostenburg. It is called Osnabrück. <laughs> Funny name, dude. Uh, yeah, but we want this to die out. Uh, how many troops would spawn? Eight and eight. Well, we would be able to deal with that. So let's wait until we get more claims. We need like 25 over here. We don't need more claims on them right away. But getting less aggressive expansion would be nice. Also, this would help. Improving war tax might be the second one. We don't have a vessel yet. So there's no need to take this right away. 
getting the improved war tax would be good. Cavalry to infantry ratio, I don't care as much about at the moment. We would get a plus one combat bonus in woods. So if they were to attack us in here, this is woods, this is grassland, and this is farmlands. We would get a plus one and they would get a negative one from rolling. It could be quite strong though. We'll see. First things first, this needs to go and they will trigger. We have lost our cost value with them, so Hanover. Yeah, we have a lot to do. Let's take uh, Mappen as a claim. And uh, this will only uh, will get us into a war with them. Uh, let's go back to Brunswick. Whose allies are... Yes, Gelre. Oldenburg has no troops. Where are you? And how many troops do you have? Yeah, that's not an, this. Ah, oh, damn, that's so annoying. Those dots. Don't know how to make them. Lundberg. Lundberg. So if we type in Berg, should be fine, right? Berg. Yeah, Lundberg. So you have six. Uh, it's not the biggest deal. Let's take you again. Uh, we could also vassalize him, but who has claims on them? Werder? I don't care about it. Actually, no one has claims on him. Vassalizing him might not be such a bad idea. However, yeah, we could take a vessel. I was kind of hoping it would be Cleves. Uh, but I have a feeling that is... Truce with... No, they don't even have a truce with France. They're just not uh, caring too much to fight. Nothing. Ah, that's annoying. Yeah, getting uh, this one as a vassal might not be so bad. Uh, eventually, we'll integrate him. And we'll take Friesland. We'll have ourselves a bit of a vassal. Yeah, why not? That would be interesting. So, fabricate claims. Let's do that. And we're going to wait to the troops of um, Osnabrück to uh, trigger. And we'll just uh, we'll have to kill them. And Hoya, oh yeah, they will die out. In 0 0.5. That's like a year, right? They will decay. Yeah, that's fine. We'll deal with that when it comes. We have a claim now on this province. Where do we send you next? Do we have a claim on you? No, we don't. Uh, we're going to get one claim on Munster over here. While the rest is still ticking. Come on, trigger already. It takes so bloody long. We have a lot of manpower. And we can actually get another ship. Okay, so the ability. Improved war tax would actually be quite nice. Uh, since we don't have a subject yet. So let's take the improved war tax for now. Uh, once uh, we wore out, we can actually get more troops to join. Which will be, would be very nice. I would like to see these guys at war. They will join. Uh, improving with Vilda, Lithuania. Uh, that's actually quite nice. Uh, Truce has expired with uh, Brandenburg. Meaning we could actually go ahead against Brandenburg. But yeah, there's little left. <laughs> there's little left of this great, once great nation. Uh, Bomifia is at war with Hungary. Yeah, I don't need that. Look at this, Poland. Poland's being a boss. I think I'm very happy that we took Poland. Did we actually get Lithuania? 
No, but it's only negative 20. So the army strength would almost um, neglect that, which would be nice. Ah, come on with those troops, man. How much does it, is it actually? Uh, the balance is slowly going up because uh, we now actually have making, are making enough tax income to pay for this. Uh, wow, the state maintenance actually got down. Very interesting. Let's get no edict over here. Yeah, that is half a docket. Nice. I really like that. Uh, so we're, we're kind of waiting here for these guys to uh, to trigger. And we're building up claims. Uh, if I could take... I want to pay off the loan. Ah, oh, there we go. That's what I wanted to see. Let's go and kill them. Uh, we have a general. We have better troops. And they don't. So yeah, it's going to be a loss. We'll fight them. And we should get rid of those um, of those rebels. We actually get a negative one here, uh, but with three point seven against two uh, three point two, yeah, we'll win. Loses stability on both ends. Missionary strength or technology cost. The clerisy loses ten loyalty. I hate you. Oh, we could do prestige. Let's do this and do that. Yeah, we won. Of course we won. Oh, I knew that we would win. Uh, but how to deal with them? 20 years. So how about we're just not going to care. Let's um, get these trips together. I still want to get myself a cannon. Maybe even two. Local unrest and good produced in Bremen. In Bremen? Didn't even know I had that. Bremen's is over here. Or Bremen's opinion of us will change. Uh, I don't care. I don't care about Bremen. At all. So... Go get yourself a new guy. We cannot afford a cannon. That is the thing. We need 30 ducats. And those casualties, that they'll heal. No problems. Yeah, we lost a troop. Um, we're going to allow this so we can actually get ourselves a cannon. Who are your allies? Let's go to over here. So, Munster, who are your allies? Uh, you're allied with leech. And you actually, you don't frighten me as, as much. We could actually take you. I don't... Well, or we could take you as a vassal. Development of 14. Mm, but you're part of the trade league. That is a problem. They will all help him. Uh, here we go, we got ourselves our claim back on Hanover, and we'll claim the other one as well. Actually, did that, did that happen sooner than with uh, Munster? Maybe. Not quite sure. So, due to the reinforcements, we're losing money here. Army maintenance plus three. And Hoya is building up. You know what? Go ahead, do it, whatever. Allied with Saxony and Archenburg. Uh, Saxony, are you still so far behind on military? You're not as far behind, but you are still my ally. Are you still my ally? You are not. Hmm. Maybe we could uh, get Saxony out and Vassalite Hesse. That is an idea. That is an idea. Vassalize Hesse. Uh, Saxony won't hate us that much. We will not break the alliance with Saxony. Yet. There's something going on over here. Hungary, Denmark, Sweden, Norway. Oh, you're getting 
owned. Who is your pal? Your pal's with Poland, right? Yeah. Hmm. That doesn't bode well. Not sure I like it. Now we should get more money. Let's just get maintenance down. Two ducats we'll make. And we're going to be paying off our loan and getting ourselves... I want two cannons at the minimum. Uh, Moonster is going to get that claim. Or actually we're going to be getting that claim on Moonster. And let's get you away from there. And let's start building up against Hesse. If we were to declare right now. Only these guys would come. Could we get him out? Like. No we cannot. He, will, he would join Hesse. And we would need to get their troops out. Deal with that troop. Occupy Hesse. And then go in towards Saxony. And we cannot ask in Poland or Austria. We don't have enough favors. Thierry would join. Not even at the problems of terror. He would actually just join. That would be enough to deal with this. I don't want any of his land. And we will vassalize him. That's, that's probably how we're going to be dealing with this. So diplomatic actions. Build up spine network. Make this a bit more tidy again. And we're building up again. How much is this loan again? Austria, did you do another one of those uh, reformation things? No. One, two, three, four, five are backing up Austria. So chances are very likely he will remain the emperor. Which is okay for now. I have a bad feeling about him getting too many reforms though. Military advisor. We're gaining two. Actually getting that advisor would not be bad. But we would like to get more boats. Get cannons. I have so many things I want. New technology. We're still plus five. We're going to wait. And build up more military points. This would get the regional camp. Um, land force limit plus one. That would be nice. Just getting one. Infantry, fire and cavalry shock. Are these new troops? Could be. But just that bonus is very cool. Getting this as well would be extremely nice as well. So um, that's building up slowly. Don't know why. It's just annoying. We lose 10 devotion. Yay. It's an. It, it, that's not good. Uh, we could probably get... Devotion from here, right? Nationalism. Yearly prestige. Diplomatic reputation. And tax income. I'm not sure. Well, yeah, we could also just buy it over here. Strengthen the government. For military points, we can buy devotion. So that's always an option if something horrible will trigger. Which is very much uh, possible. Let's take a look if we can always... Uh, if we can repay this one loan. We need 40... 41! Man, that's pure robbery! Oh wow, we're at 30 minutes again. Shit. Did not mean to do this. Did not mean to do this at all. Innovativeness is decreasing. Because this is now at negative 5. Negative 5. Still 0... So the pike and shot does save us now. Let's get the pike and shot. Here we go. And I'm ending the video up here because I didn't mean to go to 30 minutes. Hopefully you're enjoying yourself. I know I'm doing that. And I'll, uh, I'll see you uh, next time. Have a good one guys. Bye bye.